welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is Karen so for today's video is we are just going to do the continuation of my first video so this is going to be the part two of my entire inspired Hermes collection so the first item that I'm going to show you is this beautiful bag right here so this one is an inspired bag for the garden party in size 30 i really really love this bag this one is i got this one from amazon i also did a review of this one um i'm still using it up to now i still i just need to pack it really well and i also put a leather conditioner in here just to make sure that everything is gonna go well with this bag as you guys can see there are some linings markings right here all over the bag so the next item that I'm going to show you is this beautiful bag right here. This is my Birkin 25. This is my first ever Birkin 25. So this is an inspired bag. I got this in um, red color with um, gold hardware. This one also came with adjustable strap. It doesn't have a hole in here where you actually um, hook the strap so I really love this one because it is so versatile plus I love the color of this bag and the next item that I'm going to show you is this beautiful bag right here I don't think I did a review on this one as well so this is my first um, exotic um, crocodile bag i really really love this bag so much because um the the color of this bag um the way it's made by the way this is made of um faux leather so this is a peel leather i really love it this one is in gold hardware this one is kind of expensive when i got it that's um way back then because i only get everything from amazon before because i didn't know about aliexpress before so everything that uh, some of the items that you're going to see in here most it's from amazon and they're kind of way expensive but anyway um i really love this bag i i'm i wish and i'm still hoping that i will be able to get one of the exotic letters someday because i'm really really into exotic letters i remember I gave one to my grandma before as a gift. I really love this one because the way it is made, as you guys can see here at the bottom, um, this one came with um, adjustable strap as well. There is a hole on the side. Um, this is what it looks like on the inside. Um, I really take good care of this bag because I really, really love this so much. I've been using this a lot as well. Um, before when I was the first time I used it it was kind of stiff and then kind of soften up as the time goes by so here is my beautiful exotic bag um, like I said I'm still it's still on my wish list that someday I can have my real exotic bags so here it is and then the next item that I'm going to show you I think this is um my first um what's in my bag if i'm not mistaken it's this um beautiful yellow color i really really love this color so much i've been using this a lot especially on summer i really love the color this is an inspired bag i also got this one from amazon this is in yellow color with gold hardware i did um a review not review but what's in my bag on this bag before so here is the bag it's like a ray of sunshine that's why I really love the color and then the next item that I'm going to show you is also in Birkin but this one is in Birkin 30 and this is in cobalt color and this one is in gold hardware this one is still up on sale on my Poshmark if you guys are interested I do have the size 30 in black and gold as well but um, I gave that one away and so this one is up for sale if you guys are interested I really really love this bag so much it is 
I really love this one. So the next item that I'm going to show you is I did a review on this one. Yeah, I did a review on this one. So I got this one from Amazon as well. So this is my Birkin 35 in exotic leather. But this one is made of full leather. <laughs> this is not made of um, real crocodile. So please don't come after me. So like I said, I'm really, really into exotic leathers. And uh, since... Um, Hopefully one day I will be able to get one of those, but right now I'm so happy with this one. Um, so this is what it looks like. I really love the texture of this bag. It's really nice. It's really simple. I feel like it's a classic um, bag for me because of the design. So this is what it looks like. And I got this one in gold hardware. So the next item that I'm going to show you is I still have four items right here and I think you guys already know what it is so let me just grab them so we are done with the Kelly's we're done with the Lindy's we are done with the Birkins now the next item that I'm going to show you is I'm gonna call them like um, the Constance family so the next item that I'm going to show you is this beautiful bag right here so this one is, I got this one from Amazon as well. So this is the C18. Um, actually, the first item that I wanted was the tube color as well in C18. But I think at the time is they canceled my order because they don't have it on stock. And then when I ordered it again, this is the one that um, came with. I really love this one. It's See, this is what I love with the Inspire Bag because you will be able to test out the product first before you actually buy the, the expensive one, which is, it's kind of like a test for you. So this is the C18. Um, if you're going to ask me if I'm going to buy the expensive one, probably, but not right now because I still have some stuff that I need to uh do first before about purchasing another bag so here is the c18 um the next item that i'm going to show you is of course if you have the c18 you also have the bigger version which is this is not the c24 but this is the c23 so i really love this one i got this one in rose lipstick i forgot the name of the color Pretty much that's it. I got this in the gold hardware as well. I've been using this a lot. Like I mentioned in my video before, if which one to pick, if you can have both, just go for it since it's an inspired bag. But if you're only gonna get one, I would go for the C23. It's because it's just because you can pack a lot or you can put a lot more stuff in here compared to the C18. And then the next item that I'm going to show you guys, um, this is what I said. I, I said this is still on the Constance family, but it's not a Constance, but pretty much similar to Constance. So here is my mini Ruli right here. I really, really love this one. I love the color. I love the leather, as you guys can see in here. Um, it's very subtle. It doesn't scream or mess compared to the constants in here because on constants you can absolutely know that this this is from Hermes because of the H buckle but some people doesn't know that um, like you'll only know that it's a branded bag if you know the brand so this is the other one I really love this bag so much I've been using this a lot too this one you could pretty much put a lot in here so the last bag that I'm going to show you for today is this beautiful bag right here. So this is my Geta bag. Um, I would say this color is kind of confusing. It looks like a sesame color slash chai color. But anyway, I really, really love this bag until now. I still get confused where is the opening of this bag <laughs> and then because I noticed is the back and the front are kind of the same 
the only thing i knew that this is the front it's because the adjustable buckle is on the left side so <laughs> that's the opening so if this one is on the front of course you're gonna get confused already anyway so here is the bag i really love this one this one is um is an inspiration for the japanese um slippers um, i also did a review on this bag before so that's all my um that's everything so this is the end of the video Th those are my inspired bags and i hope you guys enjoy this video as much as i do and thank you guys again for watching and please don't forget to like comment and share and subscribe to my channel that would really help me a lot and um, don't forget also to hit the notification bells and i'll see you guys again next time bye